There is believed to be over 10 million iguanas on the island of Puerto Rico right now. This population is expected to double every year if nothing is done to slow their invasive growth. In addition to crop damage, iguanas are known to cause flight delays and hazards on the roads as they are out in the sun basking on the asphalt. Iguana hunters, known as Los Iguaneros, travel around the island mostly hunting on large farms to control crop damage. You are watching Iguana Wars Puerto Rico. Make sure you like, hit the red subscribe button, and leave some comments. Let's start catching these invasive Puerto Rican iguanas. Whoa. Whoa. Yep, yep. Gracias, papi. Yep, yep. Juan, yo sé que tú me quieres. <laughs> I can't, I can't. No, oh, oh, right there, right there. Don't move, don't move, don't move. Don't move, don't move. watch out, don't oh, bang him. Move. Across no, no, the street. No, no, no. You're shoot him. no, no, I can't, I can't, I can't. Why? He's too close to Oh, he banged him. Bang oh, him again, Ninja. Bang him again. Good shot. Things gonna happen once we arrive over there. Oh. <laughs> and on my hometown, we Same park. We park, and they will start running on top of the hood of your car. Same Same for me. Really? We can go there tomorrow or Sunday. Just let me know so I can I program him, that up. Okay. You, uh, yeah, he 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 did the hey, catwalk. Pay attention, and because they, they will they will come out. Oh, the bush is Mike smacking the face. What's the plan? Got it with the hand. Okay. And the he touched it. What do you mean? We start moving. All these things. I don't know. So guys, you guys see it right here. It's about noon right now, and it's it's not only lunchtime for us, but apparently it's lunchtime for these iguanas. Yeah, start moving. Drinking water. Yeah, it's coming yeah, down, so... Launch, right? It's <laughs> Alright guys, so we're just, we just have the air rifle loaded and just ready to go. So if we see any iguana, we can just... We can just pop. This is crazy, guys. We are in the Serengeti of Puerto Rico right now. See, I feel like I'm on a nature preserve right now. My nice, clean air rifle. Ready to go. The iguana ninja with the iguana man. We're living life, people. Check that three right there. That's a wall. That one right there on the right. I have something. Okay. Sorry, getting some. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, yep. another one. Hold on. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's like. On the west coast of Florida, yeah. Yep, yep. Yep, yep. Oh, Whoa. Yep, yep. Oh my yeah, goodness. You, you thank smell thank that you fresh smell you right there? Woo! Oh yeah. Farmer man do. I love that farm life. I know it sounds weird. It's a lot of work every single day. Cool fact, before Ninja was an iguana hunter, he was a full-time farmer. Full-time farmer. Ooh. Those are those birds that came with the beats. Hey, we're just over here rolling around on the truck. We got the air rifle right here. As you guys heard from our boy Julio, the iguanas are going to start crossing the road. They're going to come down so they can drink water and they need to eat food. Most importantly, to drink water because it's really hot out here. So uh, we do got the air rifle ready. She's loaded. She's on safety. But we're just going to just be rolling around just in case we see anything. We're going to put them in the bag, y'all. <laughs> exactly. What they do? Are you ready, y'all? Oh my God! Stop! Stop! Spanish. You guys, you guys can hear yourself. Reverse. He's right there. Right there. He's a big. He's right huge. Stop, stop, stop. stop. Oh, shoot. You see him right there? He's under the cows. The what? Good smack. Oh, on that trunk. Do the way like this. Good shot. Good shot. Again. He's coming down. He's coming hey. down. Oh, shoot. I'm out. Finish him off. Oh, yeah. You can't see the hand. He's right here, dog. Yeah, there's only one to the damn thing, dude. You get any more or no? No, I don't. He's right there. Guys, we're in the bush. 
We're in the bush. Oh! Yo, I can't believe he just hit the ground and then took off like that. You think that was over 10, right? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. All right, guys, we are we gotta be up on the more. We are deep in this jungle. I am getting bit by red ants, but it's okay. That's the sacrifice we're here to make. Deep in the Puerto Rico jungles. Back. Guys, I'm in here. Yo, watch these storm. This one? Yeah, thank you. Our boy Harold got him. Wow. We're pulling out monsters here, brother. Once again, the white head, the white dots that come a little more pointy. Yeah. How's it go? Look at that. Yeah, white. white. The, the crazy thing is, you're right, is the white head. It's, it's completely white. We're used to seeing blue, gray, black even, yeah. but never white. Never a white, a complete snow white head. That's so bizarre, dude. That's mm. insane. Look at that ivory white, guys. Oh, yeah, ivory, that. yeah. Good. It's, it's insane. Hey, look, look how light he is. He's, he's even got kind of a... It's like they're almost fasting or something. How they're, We keep getting them skinny. Yeah, yeah. He's yeah. telling me in April they're more plentiful, more fat, more full. Maybe yeah. right now, maybe they're getting ready for breeding season. Maybe, you know what I'm saying? They're trying exactly. to get a little bit more slender so they can they can fight other males, be more agile in the trees, and maybe attract more females. Yeah. That's that's a stud, though, dog. Look at... Oh, my gosh. Show me the back legs, though. Look at the back legs. Meaty. Massive. Straight meat. Looks like my arms. Massive. Look at that. <laughs> Nicely done, dog. Nicely done. Another really one good. in the bag, y'all. Oh, Just like that. Oh, come on. Thank you. Oh. You're growing up. Because, hey, yeah. Uh, look at the high. Oh. That's great. It's Anthony. Yeah. That was a nice shot. Yeah, in my phone. That's Just nice shot. Thank God. All right, y'all. So we we do need it. We are collecting as much data as possible. So far, we got a couple that are nine pounds. We got one that's over ten. Uh, we're gonna see how. We're gonna try to confirm the weight of this big bull right here. We're trying to find the world's biggest iguana, and we think they might be here in Puerto Rico. It's just a theory, guys, and we're just trying to get as much data as physically possible. But there are a lot of giants here. Hold on one second. No, no. Uh, hold on, wait. Hold lay it on the floor. Lay it on the floor. Yeah, lay it on the floor. Let it get on zero, and then put it up. Because because it was okay. Now pull pull them up now. Pull them straight up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 11. 11. 11. Yeah, yeah. Hey. Biggest one. Biggest one, y'all. Hold on. We're breaking. We're breaking the ten-digit mark. We're 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 in the elevens now. Hold on. Yeah, I think we. I think it weighs more. The tail was touching the floor. Really? Yeah. All right, guys. I'm five seven, brother. I know. That thing's probably taller than I am. No, nope. he's eleven. Well, he's eleven one. He is. He's eleven. He's eleven. Yep. He's eleven. Same thing. He's eleven. Him. He's eleven. All right. So that's the biggest one so far. Good job, bro. He ain't missing any Good job. No, no, no. You finished. Good job. Good job. All right, boys. We gotta head out of here. This street's full of iguanas also. Oh yeah, I see one. See, we're well, gonna park right here. See one. As you guys seen from the last video, we harvested all these giants. Now it's time to put them on ice and preserve the meat, y'all. It's really hot out here. It's a heat index is probably in the in the 90s as you guys can see very dry terrain so we got to make sure and preserve our meat guys because we are going to be doing a big feast here in a little bit but there is more iguana removal to be to be done look at this embankment right here y'all it drops down about a good 30 40 feet and uh iguanas are all over here by this riverbank we just need to spot them once we do that we utilize the air rifles then we teach him a fat lesson and of course we're gonna you know just put him in the back but 
Stay tuned, guys. We are in big Goanna territory. Just keep your eyes peeled. We'll be back. Boys do not play. <laughs> Rolled him. FX, baby. FX, bull pup. You see that, Ninja? Yeah. Rolled him. It was at this moment that he knew. You just grab the back legs like you want a man something. Can't scratch me. Hey guys, hey, that was epic right there, man. Hey, I want y'all to stay tuned because we got a lot more iguana action coming soon. We're out here in Puerto Rico. We're helping our boys out at the uh, Puerto Rican PCP Club, y'all. We're uh, helping them with the re removal jobs, eradication of non-indigenous species. Most importantly, the green iguanas that are out here. So if this is something you want to see, make sure you smash the thumbs up, uh, smash the red subscribe button with the bell on. Let me know your favorite parts in the comments down below. We got a lot more removal to do. We got Iguana Ninja. He's over there with our buddy Joe. I'm riding with Harold right here. And we are on to the next job. See you guys there.